For decades, our relationship with workplace technology has been, in a word, complicated. The pandemic only made it more so. The stats are astonishing. Two in three employers can't find qualified candidates to fill their open IT positions. By 2024, the deficit of software developers in the United States alone will hit 500,000. Supply and demand for techies are out of whack. And, most alarmingly, there's no end in sight. The effects of this labor market imbalance are profound and difficult to overstate. Nearly three in four technology leaders can't focus on their strategic priorities. Countless other firms, departments, teams, and leaders struggle because IT can't deliver the tools they so desperately need. Adding salt to the wound, business units now need new applications to address the logistical challenges that pervasive remote and hybrid work present. Organizations are at a crossroads. They need to solve these thorny tech problems now. But how? In low-code, no-code, citizen developers and the surprising future of business applications, world-renowned workplace technology expert and award-winning author, Phil Simon, squares this circle. His 13th book deftly illustrates how. TLDR Thanks to powerful new tools and a new breed of employees, organizations are finally fulfilling critical business needs and reducing their reliance on pricey software developers. Low-code, no-code is an invaluable treasure trove. It's chock-full of insightful analysis, synthesis, case studies, examples, and advice. The book has arrived at the perfect time. Get ready to learn why, in the words of GitHub co-founder and former CEO, Chris Wanstreth, the future of coding is no coding at all. Cool.